Uh, congratulations to our guys for an outstanding win. I mean, that was huge. Senior day, uh, it was going to be one of those games where we knew tough opponent winning, uh, you know, going against the winning team. Uh, and the things that Tiffin does just to, that gives people problems, we knew it was going to be a great challenge. And for our guys to rise to the occasion like they did today, accept that challenge, and, and do the things we did and take it to them and, and play hard and be able to handle all the adversity that happens during the course of a football game and still cut, come out victorious, uh, I, I think that was huge. Awesome victory and well-deserved for our guys. Second straight big week out of the defense. Talk about how well they've been playing. I, I mean, what they've been doing is, is really two things. Limiting big plays. You saw today they hit the one on us. Last week they hit one on us, but not a ton. And, and, and I think that's where it starts. Great pressure on the quarterback, stopping the run, being really good against the run. Uh, and then I, I saw our DBs uh, play as well as I've seen them play in a long time. I mean, we were knocking, we were breaking up passes, hitting hard. Uh, when somebody caught the football, we had somebody right there to eliminate uh, a bunch of yards after the catch. Uh, you, know, you know, Adam Gonzaga and our defensive staff did a great job with the scheme this week of preparing for that type of offense. And, and our kids executed it, executed it to a T. That's as physical as we've played all year. Uh, there was a ton of energy. And our guys got to the football, and that's what you got to do. You got to hit hard. You got to be physical. You got to run to the football, and you got to make plays on the ball. And we did that today. What was the message to the defense after Tommy's fumble when when Tiffin took back over late? That's a tough situation because they come up with a big stop. We're, we're going to try to run the football, but you know, was, do the same thing you just did. Mm -hmm. the, the biggest difference was we were a lot more tired uh, running back on the field after the previous drive, and they had to dig deep. And that's where it came down to, in my opinion. Uh, how hard our guys have worked, you know, throughout the course of the year, whether it's been the, the off season, the summer conditioning, and, and the amount of effort they put into our in season workout. Because, you know, late in the fourth quarter, when you're tired and you got to dig deep, they were able to dig deep into that reserve tank and come up big for us again. The offense didn't shoot the lights out today, but they did what they needed with how well the offense or with how well the defense was playing. What impressed you about their performance? Uh, you know, you know, really, I, I thought for the most part we did a good job of run blocking. You know, we had a, a couple plays where we where we lost yardage and got put in tough down distance situations. But when we needed to make a big play, we did. Uh, two drives down there. You know, I thought we had one drive where, where uh, we came up short with the field goal, and then the other one we stalled. But uh, we made a lot of big plays today. Galliard's making big plays again. Tommy Scott made big plays in the run. We threw him a, we threw him a pass where we made a big play. Conklin continues to be accurate. And our old line's getting it done, you know, to a level that we need him to get it done. We need to score more points than that, but today was enough. Yeah. And with the way our defense played, uh, you know, that last uh, the last turnover was a tough one. You know, it, it was a tough one because up to that point we had turned the ball over, playing really really sound. But uh, like I said, defense came up big there at the end. But. You know, the things we're doing on offense is protecting the football. We're making our share of explosive plays. And, and Tommy Scott's running hard. He's running really hard. Made some people miss today. Made some big plays. Yeah. What's the excitement like this week now heading into a rivalry game against Northwood? Well, it, you know, we, we just we had great excitement in the locker room right there, Connor. I mean, our guys are fired up. This was a big win. Uh, and, and the good thing about it is w with an opponent like Northwood coming up, big rivalry game, Axeville, there's not going to be a letdown after a big win. You know, a lot of times you win a big game like that, and there's a tendency to have a letdown. But but this group is too mature to let that happen, and they know what's at stake with the Axe Bowl, and they'll be ready to come back tomorrow and get ready.